I'm fascinated by the draft rooms and what goes on behind the scenes. And you've been in many of these over the years and involved in many drafts from your from your days in Minnesota to your time in Baltimore as the head coach. And I believe you were in Minnesota when you guys drafted Randy Moss, correct, Coach? Yeah, uh-huh, sure was. W- was that your yeah, that single was, greatest draft it, pick of all time? Yeah, that was, that was pretty good. I remember Denny Green came to me, and Denny Green, God rest his soul, was the best evaluator of talent of any coach I've ever been around. Would have been a great general manager. And, I, and, and ran the draft beautifully. And I remember when he came to me, he said, Brian, we're, we're going to get Randy Moss. I think we were 21 or 22. And I'm 21. thinking, well, okay, the old man's lost it. There's no way Randy Moss is going to fall. I've done my homework, even though I knew there's no way he's going to get there. Right. Um, once he got past Dallas or 10 or 11, there was a free fall. And all of a sudden, now 21, we get a Randy Moss. And it was, uh, I mean, it was interesting. Chris Carter called me. And he had been working out with Chris Carter. And Chris Carter used to have a workout camp. In yeah, Florida. down at Boca, the fast program. I remember that. Yeah, and 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 he called, and he said, Brian, you, you, this is unbelievable. You can't believe how good this guy is. He says, no, Chris is unbelievable. I'm looking at the film right now. We're going to be able to do this and that. This. He goes, Brian, no, listen to me. You have no idea how good this kid is. And Chris saw it then. And so, yeah, that was uh, that was one of the special draft days to be able to get Randy Moss at 21. I'm look. I'm looking at the numbers here. <laughs> His rookie year. Holy cow! It was 1998? Randy Moss had 69 catches. All right, that's okay for 1,300 yards and 17 touchdowns. Yeah, yeah. He, you talk about the guy that could take the top off the deep. And and keep in mind now, I also had Hall of Famer uh, uh, Chris, Chris Carter. Carter for that underneath in the slot. I had Robert Smith in the backfield. Uh, Randall Cunningham at quarterback. Um, uh, was Jake Reed Leroy there? Gl- uh, yeah, we we had some guys now. Great offensive line. I mean, we had some weapons. We, the defenses just didn't know what because you had to start accounting for Randy, so you had to back up. Well, we could wear you out with Chris underneath or run the ball, and uh, Randy was unbelievable that rookie year. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.